430, Lahaina residents who choose to remain in their homes are concerned about the air quality, and that's adding air purifiers to the list of the items they're requesting. And as Lynn Kohana reports, they're hoping the devices will help them stay safe in the months ahead. Neighborhood hubs have popped up around Lahaina as the community works to support each other. Yeah. On Kui Alua Street in the Kilauea Malka neighborhood, people stop by day and night for essentials. Set up like a garage sale, donations are organized and laid out on tables under tents. But money is not needed here to get bags of supplies. Thank you. And While much of this has been offered to strangers for the last two weeks, there has been an increase in requests for one item. We need air purifiers here for all the residents. Blake Rommel put out a social media call for device donations to have at his grandfather's hub, and within 24 hours... We got respirators in here. Um, we have filters for those respirators. The area in and around Lahaina has been deemed unsafe due to toxic chemicals released when buildings and cars burn. This might not be the solution, but this is what people are asking for. And if people are asking it from me, I'm going to do my best to get it to them. Most of the neighborhoods immediately surrounding the impact zone were evacuated, even though their homes were still standing. That's because of air quality issues, debris, and a lack of clean water and power. Despite the warnings, many have chosen to stay. You know, my family's been here for so long, and this is where they grew up. This is their home, and, you know, they don't want to leave their home, and they also want to make sure everything that's in their home right now stays there, too. That's why the neighborhood Hui is so important to them. They didn't lose everything, but they're still breathing the stuff that's coming up here. It's hard to breathe, and I'm only here for like five minutes or an hour. On the Makai side of the bypass road, homebound kupuna are getting items delivered. Today we got to give away all the water and all the produce to all of the people that are in there. Our whole purpose is to get the resources to the people who really need it the most, especially those that are kind of forgotten, um, that are in the home, that are, are kupunas. Pakalana Phillips' home burned down in the fire, but she is still working to help others. Even though we've lost everything that we have, we still are alive. And so we want to make sure that we're taking care of our people. In Lahaina, I'm Lynn Kawano, Hawaii News Now. Thank you very much, Lynn. Now, many tough questions. Have